Hello and welcome, thank you very much yeah. guys for tuning in. My name is Kendama, right here on this beautiful channel. I would love you to have that support of yours, you know, by subscribing no, and give banda. your thumbs up. Okay. Today's video, I am here in, um, I'd call it, Kalumbu. Uh, this is the area where, um, you know, uh, it's a tourist area here on this uh, Kwanzaa River uh, is about uh, 60 kilometers away from the capital city uh, Luanda, Angola um, and then it's really nice to come here uh, especially on the weekend just to chill out and to compress after hours of uh, conjunction that are always happening in you know, on the streets of Rwanda, uh, the most craziest uh, city, if you may say. Um, but uh, yeah, being here weekends, um, probably cool and chill. Um, yeah, today I'm just here chilling out on this water here, the River Kwanza, one of the biggest uh, river here in, in, in Angola. You know, uh, but besides uh, Rio Kwanza is being said in Portuguese, there is also different other uh, rivers like uh, Kikush is another river, Zambezi, uh, and many other uh, kind of rivers that you find in the country. You know, I will just be a little, a little, uh, you know, a cri critic or criticize a little bit of the government. As you may know, that uh, Angola had a civil war for many, many years, and then this party uh, was in currently in power, it's been in power for 45, 46 years now, uh, close to 47. You know, uh, even though there is all this, you know, uh, natural resource, water everywhere they never had a chance to uh, the capacity to distribute the water to all the community in, in Angola. In Luanda, uh, where people rely on um, this uh, distribution of the, the, the water through uh, a system um, uh, trucks where you know, each one have got a, like a, a, not the, a tank in the house where, where the, the, the trucks goes into these rivers by the water or tap the water in this case and come to supply to, uh, to us. The water never been that clean um, and yeah, uh, it's really sad to see how the country is being managed in this direction where people that don't have a vision, politicians that don't have vision to maintain this country uh, is the best place ever because we have got the best natural resource, the best weather, the best, I mean the best everything, you know, but still we cannot uh, make it um, happening. We have always got a problem, you know, um, and the problem relies on for one person to think that he is more intelligent than the others. We cannot be given in, in, in kind of opinion. Um, we have just to uh, listen and rely to this particular person, you know, leader, president, whatever, think he is the only person who knows everything and he controls everything. So, and cannot even uh, let people think on their own. They have to depend on one particular man, one particular person to uh, resolve all the situation in the country, which is the most ridiculous thing that uh, someone can imagine. Yeah, here, um, going around, trying to see how uh, it is this, uh, um, this, 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 this place here. You know, um, it's about saying like, uh, the problem of water distribution is not only in the capital city, Luanda. You go in the entire country, we have got the same problem. Especially on the south part of the country, people even are running away from uh, from from that part of the country and go to neighboring country. Namibia is mainly the destination where people are going because they don't have a food, and they don't have a food because they haven't been uh, raining lately so much. 
there's a river pass through uh, that that uh, that uh, that province, but the government doesn't know how to use or to make canals for irrigation the crop. They just allow people to to you know dying. People are dying of hunger in this. this uh, not the part like this where I am. I'm talking about on the, on, the, on, the, on the south part of the country. People are dying there, running away from the country, going to neighboring country in India because we have uh, administrative governments and all these people. They don't think with their own brain to make it um, people to make their life. They just thinking word what the president have to tell them to do, and this is exactly what they do, and this is really sad. They've got everything on their hands, the natural resource, but still we are facing hunger. We are facing people um, not having something to eat. This is the most, I mean, the most um, uh, stupid thing, if may put it that way. I can't believe people are dying of hunger, even though they've got there's so much natural resource so much good soil to produce uh, food, water, but they don't, I don't, I, I don't know why they don't learn from Israel. Israel doesn't have a natural soil uh, the same as here in, in Angola or in Africa in, in general, but they produce so much food and we don't do it. I really don't get it why these people don't learn um, uh, from, from, from all other countries but anyway yeah that is exactly what it is uh, I'll just let you to, to, to watch the video and, and hope you like it remember to subscribe and give me a thumbs up and they'll bring you uh, the second part of this video on the next one thank you very much be together and please see you next time Tá bom? 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 Tá Eu vou comprar um quanto para tirar com isso. Parece que não é mais barato. Se está apressado, você podia me deixar, eu podia continuar com eles. Ah. Podia me deixar, você como está embora, eu podia continuar com eles. E agora ficava bom? Não, eu dava todo o dinheiro só. Você me cobrou. Porque você tá, já vai me deixar assim. Eu você queria... Contou. Queria poder andar mais.
Tu ajuda já porque senão não posso subir aí. É como está apressado. Hã? Aí no, no embarcador é nosso embarcador para sair. Aí no embarcador. O barco está ali. Não, não, não. 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 Não, Tá embalando na praça. Se vou subir, até vim trazer uma cor. 